It was one simple decision, one simple word, and it changed my life completely. I had read Dostoevsky's Brothers Karamazov, and I thought it would be really cool if I could read it in Russian. So I ordered Rosetta Stone, and the day after I started learning Russian, I went out with a group of my friends. Up at the top of the Dana Hotel, there's a, a rooftop bar. There was a Friday night, some girl runs up to me and says, are you Russian? I'm like, yes. <laughs> I racked my brain for anything I could remember and said, Yablaka. So basically, I just said, Apple. <laughs> <laughs> We exchanged numbers, and within a couple months, we started dating. Then uh, a year later, we got engaged, and... Uh... Fast forward a couple years, we have a beautiful little girl named Evelina. I speak Russian to Evie whenever possible, just around the household or reading short children's books, and then we watch Russian cartoons together. That's Repka. I'm very proud of Antonia. She is getting better and better all the time. I think the thing I like most about Rosetta Stone is that you're learning in sort of this very natural setting. It didn't just teach you vocabulary, it also helps you with your pronunciation. So if you made the wrong sound, it would let you know. So as often as possible, we try and get our families together. So it's always a, a great blend of Russian and American culture to be able to sit at dinner and ask them questions and be able to understand what they were telling me, get to know them better, and to have them get to know me. It's hard to describe how much it means. Andrei Nushin Gavarit Parvusky Bolshev. Ah, Joseph. I never imagined that I would have such a cross-cultural family, you know, having a bilingual household and uh, a whole family on the other side of the world. Hey, previous, everybody! <laughs> it really is the smallest decisions that make the biggest difference. Just learning a single word changed my life.